Cannon D's here with Baltimore Wallace Yellow Jacket men's soccer player Logan Davis. Logan, a 3-3 tie here with Wilmington tonight at George Finney Stadium. Um, speaking of the tie, that's your second back-to-back -back overtime game. What does that do to a team? Back-to-back uh, -back overtimes are obviously difficult. You're playing 110 minutes back-to-back uh, -back against two OEC teams where everything is earned, nothing's given in this conference. So to battle back like the way we did, coming out at half, getting a goal in the second half really propelled us for the rest of the game. Yeah, that's just 220 minutes of hard talking. This game you tied 3-3. Three to three. The last two, unfortunately, did not go that way. What was the difference tonight between this game and the last two OEC games? I think tonight we really took our family atmosphere and brought it together, and we really fought for each other. Every play, people are making plays. If one person makes a mistake, we got their back. So we just cover a balance for each other all game, all the way to the last whistle. Yeah, and you mentioned how tough the OEC is. Um, coming up next week, you have a very tough John Carroll team to play against. What's it going to be like this week going into training? How are you going to change things or not change things? Uh, going forward, I think with the next two days off, getting back on the training ground on Monday, it's definitely going to help us, help our legs after these two, two long overtime games. And we're going to go in. I thought tonight was one of the best performances um, that we've had all season, and we just have to grow from here and, you know, put them away early. Yeah. Thank you for your time, Logan. You're here first with Logan Davis, Baldwin yeah. Wallace, Yellow Jacket, Men's Soccer. Yeah.